Dear audience, welcome back. I hope that you all are fine. Today again I have come here and with a new video tutorial on addition and subtraction of integers. Dear audience, in case of addition of two integers, we have to add two integers of the same sign and subtract smaller integer from larger integer of different sign. In both cases, it is required to prove the sign of the greater or equal numbers. Dear audience, here are some examples are given. Uh, with these examples, we will clarify this general rule. Dear audience, in the first example, it is asked to add 6 and 2. So first of all, we write 6 and 2. Since we are going to find out the sum of 6 and 2, so we put the plus sign between 6 and 2. There is no sign before the 6 and there is a plus sign before the 2. Dear audience, you should keep it in your mind that if there is no sign at the beginning of the expressions, we have to consider there is a plus sign. So there is no sign means there is a plus sign. That means before the 6 there is a plus sign and before the 2 there is a plus sign. Here we are going to find the sum of the two integers of the same sign. That means we have to add these two numbers or two integers. If we add 6 and 2, we will find 8. So we put here 8. But between these two numbers, which one is greater? Obviously 6 is greater. And before 6 there is a plus sign, so we should put plus sign before the sum 8. But since 8 is single number and there is no other numbers here, so if we do not put the plus sign at the beginning of the sum, it will do. In example 2, it is asked to add 6 and minus 2. So I put here 6 and minus 2. But when the negative number will be given, then obviously we have to enclose that negative number. Since minus 2 is negative number, so I have enclosed it within the parenthesis. And within this two number, I put the plus sign as we are going to add these two numbers. Here, first of all, we have to remove the bracket. According to the rule of, of removing the bracket, we just remove the bracket uh, because before the bracket there is a plus sign if there is a plus sign so we just remove the bracket and the sign of the terms inside the bracket won't be changed so in place of minus 2 I will put here minus 2 here if we compare these two numbers then we find that before 6 there is a plus sign and before 2 there is a minus sign that means here are two numbers of the different sign. So we have to subtract the smaller number 2 from the greater number 6. Then we will find the 4. But between these two numbers without sign, 6 is greater. And before 6 there is a plus sign, so we should put here plus sign. But if we do not put the plus sign at the beginning of the expression, it will do. So we will skip it. In Example 3, it is asked to find the sum of the minus 6 and 2. So, in closing the minus 6 within the bracket, we put here and then 2. Within these two number, we put plus because we have to find the sum. To remove the bracket, first of all, we have to find out what is the sign before the bracket. Here, no sign. That means there is a plus sign. If there is a plus sign before the bracket, we just put the numbers or terms inside the bracket here. So I have done that things. That means in place of minus 6, I put here minus 6. That means no sign will be changed. In place of 2, I put here plus 2. 
but before 6 there is a minus and before 2 there is a plus that means there are two uh, numbers or integers of the different sign so you have to subtract you have to subtract the smaller one from the greater one without sign here 2 is the smaller one, smaller number or smaller integer and 6 is the greater uh, integer so if we subtract 2 from 6 we will have 4 but between these two numbers um, 6 is greater without sign so but there is a minus sign before this greater number 6 so we put the minus sign here it, because it is the rules that before the sum we have to put the sign of the greater number in example 4 it is asked to find out the sum of the minus 6 and minus 2 so we put here minus 6 and minus 2 and closing those two numbers within the bracket within the two different brackets and between these two numbers we put the plus sign removing the bracket we find the minus 6 and minus 2 here and again we find there are two numbers of the same sign that means minus minus so we have to add these two numbers if we add these two numbers we will have the h and between these two numbers 6 and 2 not minus 6 and minus 2 I am telling, uh, telling that between 6 and 2 2 is smaller and 6 is greater so we have to put the sign of the greater number before the sum here since greater, greater number is 6 and before 6 there is a minus sign so I put here minus sign I uh, happen to put this minus sign here exactly I put here the sign of the greater number in example it is very familiar so I no need to discuss about this fact in 6 number we will find that we have to find the sum of minus 2 and minus 2 here um, I put here minus 2 and minus 2 removing the bracket but since this two, there are two same terms or same integers of the same sign so you have to add if we add these two integers then we will have 4 but we have to put the sign of greater number or equal number since here 2 and 2 are equal so we have to put the sign of any of them that means uh, since there are minus sign before the both of the numbers so we we'll put any of them I put here only minus that means uh, since there is minus before the these two and these two also now we have to find the sum of 1 minus 2 3 and minus 4 here I put those number but negative number are enclosed in the bracket now firstly we have to remove the bracket and removing the bracket we have 1 minus 2 plus 3 minus 4 and if we do the first two one then we have there is a plus sign before the 1 and there is minus sign before the 2 since these two numbers are the um, two numbers of the different signs so I have to subtract if we subtract 1 from 2 then we will have 1 but before between 1 and 2 uh, 2 is greater and before the greater number 2 there is a minus sign, sign so I put your minus again if we do the mathematical operations on 3 and minus 4 then we will have the uh, minus 1 why because uh, 4 is the greater number and before the greater number 4 there is a minus sign I put here minus sign again there are two integers of the same sign so we have to add if we add 1 and 1 then we we'll have 2 and we we'll put the minus sign of the equal integers your audience I hope that you could understand the today's lesson and you are able to uh, find out any sum of any number of integers your audience I hope that again I will come along with the new video tutorials till then goodbye